Isn't this house amazing? It's called Kerner's Folly, and it's certainly the most famous house in Kernersville. It was built in 1880 by artist Jewel Kerner, and it's got a lot of architectural oddities. Let's go take a tour. Susanna, tell me about the person who lived here. Well, his name was Jewel Kerner, and he was, by all accounts, a very interesting individual. So he got his start as a photographer and a fine art painter, but then he switched to interior design and decoration. And why is this called Kerner's Folly? As family legend has it, there was a farmer who was passing by in his wagon, and he said, that building will be Jewel Kerner's folly, meaning a foolish or expensive mistake. But it also can mean a piece of architecture that is very unusual or whimsical. Jewel, being the kind of eccentric man that he was, really took that name and wore it as a badge of honor. And he called this place Kerner's Folly. I'd say the most fascinating things about this place are um, the variety that you can see. So we are here in the children's playroom. Watch your head. <laughs> so this room was actually created when Jewel divided the room below horizontally, forming two rooms and really small, cozy spaces for his children to play. So here we are in the library. It's a tiny library in some respects. <laughs> it is, and if you can believe it, it actually used to be a stable. Oh, really? <laughs> there are very few closets, actually, and there are none in this room. There's a whole room over here called the private dressing room. So here we are in Cupid's Park Theater can see the many amazing murals that are here on the walls. And a little stage, this is crazy. <laughs> yes, Jewel converted this room from his bachelor billiards room to um, a stage and a space for his wife, Polly Alice, in her juvenile lyceum. Jewel's wife, Polly Alice, was really instrumental in creating a program for young children in Kernersville. She would write the plays, make the costumes. Jewel, the painter, of course, would do the scenic design. And Polly Alice even learned to play the cello so they could have a family orchestra. Jewel Kerner lived his life um, in a really unapologetically creative way up until the very end of his life. He took a house that was originally 11 rooms and after he got married, it became 22 rooms. And he never stopped tinkering. Even upon his deathbed, he was imagining new uses, new rooms, new furnishings for his beloved Folly. Kerner's Folly is at 413 South Main Street in Kernersville, and it's open Tuesday through Saturday from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. For more information, give them a call at 336-996-7992 or visit them online at kernersfolly.org.